Greetings and welcome, fellow patricians, to another episode of Let's Play Patrician 3. Alright. My beer fleet is totally grounded because of a siege in Staten. I was wondering where the sieges were, but... I'm still baffled that this thing burned down when they are attacking over here. I mean, they're not moving in with another army or anything. Not that the game does stuff like that, but still. I know, I know. You can't do business. What do you want me to do about it? Right. Still on the top of the list to be the next Lord Mayor. I know, I I really want this siege to be over too. But it doesn't look like the defenses are going to be able to break it, although they do seem to be uh, getting the uh, trebuchets down. <laughs> yes. I have achieved the game's objective. And I could say that this would be the end of the episode and thank you all for watching, but I feel like I kind of a jip because I kind of knew this was coming. I considered going longer on the, other, on the previous episode, but screw that, I want to build my wall. So we're going to play, continue on playing, if the game will let me. Game ends, alright, continue playing. I'm going to make the... Uh, your town coffers. Let's see. How do I do this again? Uh, town info. Make an offer. Enlarge the town's walls. Which will be on the 28th of April. Let's. Phew! One vote! I got one vote more! <laughs> but it did it! I am the greatest! Honorable, successful Lord Mayor Leopenthla. The Hanseatic League Council has long been observing your meteoric rise and establishing yourself as one of the most successful traders in the Hanseatic League. Even the office of Alderman appears to be coming within your grasp in not distant future. However, consider this, only someone who is exemplary in supporting the Hanseatic League's interest and expansion can become, expect to become Alderman. Therefore, accept and fulfill special contracts and prove yourself worthy by the deeds as well as with your gold. Come to my office in the town hall of Cologne, so that we can have a little chat about some Hanseatic League business. The successful Alderman Malte Malberg. <laughs> Alright, is this siege over yet? Oh. Fighting has commenced. They did beat down the... Uh, it looks like they beat down the trebuchets, but I don't think the town guards can handle that much. Alright, well... While that is going on, we'll just see about this. And uh, let's see, Cologne. You know what? Screw it. 
Build me a crayer. Alright, I'm definitely going to be building another timber uh, sawmill. Just fast forward a few more days. Siege is over. They've actually been driven off. <laughs> yeah, I know you're stuck here. Well done. Church extension is almost finished. <sighs> now, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to push this, uh, this thing I want. Try. Now, of course, I could be a little bit sneaky and just, you know, lower the taxes for me, but that won't help the city. Hmm. Looks like we'll have the uh, Hansa meeting before the town meeting. Just be hiring more people again. We've got plenty of beggars. All right. And everything here should be coming back into operation. Yeah, because everyone was hiding in the walls. Yeah, you go active again. Probably not much beer here, but there should be some. And I also want to replace one of my breweries once the iron goods arrive. Which will take a while. And now Riga's on the siege. On the wrong side! Oh, joy of joys. A large town's monster, I accept the motion, cast my vote. I get two votes because I am mayor. But it looks like this will pass easily. I mean, frankly, why it hasn't been done already, I am stumped, but just keep going. There's no further. I'll just pray. Pray the day away. Today, the council reached the decision that the town walls are to be enlarged. Right. Now, I should have access to military buildings now. So I can now build a town wall. And you do have to build it exactly to the specifications that the uh, town says, so... Now, uh, let's see, town wall... You have to build a piece of wall. I've got plenty of goods, so... Just build pieces of wall until it's done. And because I'm using my own money for this, I don't have to pay the, f the bill at the end. 
Although I think I'm gonna go and stop by a city that has some actual uh, timber for sale. Um, you have some timber, perhaps? Oh, you have plenty of timber. Bob, go pick me up some timber in uh, Staten. should help me get a little bit done a little bit faster All right, you're repairing All right build more wall I mean this is uh, that the wood the, the wolf uh, the wolf the wood the timber from uh, statins really just to shoot the works a bit most of my trade routes are pretty much self-sufficient at this stage, and I don't really need much of my input. Alright, and now my bricks are out. Deliver the tinder uh, to the office. Let's see how far we can get this episode. Yeah, even the town is running out of bricks at this stage. Eh, yeah, it's still cheap enough. Now we're out of the bricks. Right, who makes bricks? Do you make bricks? You do make bricks. Mm, you don't have the biggest amount, but you'll have some, so a clue. Give me your bricks. Ooh, plague. Yeah. That's no boy, no. Let's also have a bath. Usancte spiritus, linguas tanquam in nis in apostolos descendens. Amen. Now, aside from walls, of course, I can also build the Port Bombard, if I had the resources for it. And the Port Cannon. I mean, we have got places for that, but I don't think they're fully implemented. Regardless. Let's get back to the wall. And the pitch shoots. Yeah, I can only do that once the gate is finished. Right, 
and I got enough for three more pieces of wool. Isn't it a thing of beauty? I mean, we're also the only town to have done this so far, so... Kinda surprised that we are the only town that has done this so far. Because you can get uh, the towns to do this by themselves. But uh, for some reason it's still happening here, so... Not sure what's going on there. Alright, who else makes bricks? You make bricks. You have plenty of bricks. Let's go collect some bricks. Let go, get some bricks. That was terrible. Oh, an official writing from the prince. He's unable to afraid to pay me the squashed up amount of gold. Unfortunate incident in your country. Kill surprise, but you know, as long as you stay away, I'm fine. Well, at least the town is fairly good at making bricks. The trader swear of Lübeck cannot repay it for me. Nah, uh, in this case I'll be lenient. If it's only his first time offense. Right. I do kind of like that even the walls kind of have to keep getting built. It, it feels more real that way. Alright, we're definitely running a bit low on big iron from time to time. May have to up the production again. Or I would, you know. You know, this stage, my trade's just running off on autopilot. Doesn't really need my input. It'll keep happening. I just want to build the wall. Do not a brick in the wall. Uh, if, at least I would if we had some more bricks. And right now I can't go to Rostock. Malmo, do you make bricks? Well, you have some, but I don't think you make them. Oh, you do make them. Good. All right, Bob, chase over to Malmo. Steal all their bricks for a certain amount of gold. been finished. Alright. 
right. And can I do the pitch shoot? Not enough materials. Oh well. Oh well. That'll be it for my playthrough of Patrician 3, for the time being as it is. Uh, I have achieved my goal, and I'm quite happy with what I've learned so far. Hopefully I will not have forgotten it next time I start playing this game. I may return to Patrician 3 at some point to do something different, most likely. But what I will do in the meantime, well, we'll see about that, won't we? Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.